Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you a tool called Nuon Writer. If you are someone that's trying to rank your articles into the first page on Google, then you need to look at Nuon Writer. So Nuon Writer is, is a content optimizing tool that can help you rank high in the Google search results. It uses NLP, natural language processing. It will also help you analyze some of the 30 competitors on the market and to show you what kind of titles they're using, what kind of H1s, H2, H3s they're also using. They'll also provide you like the top, top common questions that people would ask on the internet. So let's just look at their website. So first page tells you they optimize website content. So Google loves it. This is one of their dashboard, one of their layout. I'll show you how the portal looks inside. So as it says, it's NLP based recommendations for content and draft documents, give you content score based on the, the words, the keywords that you have. It can help you come up with content ideas as well as the AI content writing. So a lot of other AI copywriters out there would have this because when newer writers started, all their focus was just on optimizing content. But as the product starts to mature, they're now coming up with their own AI content writer as well. I believe they're also using GPT-3 uh, Da Vinci as the language model. So the quality would be good. So that's something we'll be testing out as well. So let's talk about pricing. So Nuon Writer on their website, they've got five different packages, bronze, silver, gold, platinum, and diamond. The majority of the difference are between the bronze, silver, and gold, where you can see the feature differences will be on a schema, data explore, uh, Google search console integration, content management, as well as plagiarism checks. These are the core features difference in these plan. And then in platinum plan and diamond plan are just the numbers. So. You'll get 10 projects for a gold plan, but then in diamond plan, it's 50, but all the features are the same. So just want to make sure if you want to pick up all the features in Nuon Rider, the gold plan, it will be good. And let's look at some of the competitors out there. So server SEO is probably one of the more well-known content optimizer tool out there. But if you look at their pricing, $99 per month, you will have 30, uh, 360 articles per year. That means every single month you have 30 articles to work with. And on Nuon Writer, you will get 75 content per month. So you get way more and almost like half of the price. But we're gonna not going to use the standard monthly plans. The time I've uploaded this video, Nuon Writer is on AppSumo and they are offering a lifetime deal. So what this means is you can buy it one time and never pay again. And the pricing is very similar to their website. So for one code, which is plan that the first plan, uh, it's a 69 US dollars one time purchase. You'll get two projects, 25 content analysis queries, which is uh, the content optimizing feature. They will provide you 15,000 AI credits per month. That's not a lot because, you know, if you, if you're going to write a lot of blogs, articles, 15,000 words per month is nothing. So because this tool is not particular, only focus on AI copywriting. So you might have some other tools like uh, word hero, creator AI or go Charlie or some of the other common ones out there. So I personally would just use Nuon Writer for the content optimization purpose instead of using their AI copywriting tools. And if you stack up to two, you'll get five projects, 50 content analysis, uh, 30,000 AI credits. Then you start to have some other tools like in internal link suggestions, a schema, data explorers, new content ideas. I think for me, as anyone starting to use Nuon Writer or trying to optimize their content. I think going for the gold plan, uh, the third stack altogether, uh, it'll be $207. You'll get 10 projects, 75 content analysis courage per month. 
uh, 45,000 AI credits, and then you get all these other features. You'll get the plagiarism checker as well. So if you don't have Grammarly Premium, then this one will be very useful. And if you can stack them up to five codes, so you'll get 150 content analysis per month. So that depends how many blog articles you are generating per month. So I think getting the getting three codes or at least the gold plan would be the best for a new on writer. But if you know you're gonna do more than like a hundred blog articles per month, then going for the full stack would be would be the best, I think. So let's jump into the dashboard. I'm now inside the Neuron Writer dashboard. So in my gold subscription, I can create up to 10 projects. So in here, you can create your initial project. And then after creating a project, you can click on any of the projects. So I've got a test project here. Click on it. And it's going to show you all the previous uh, queries that you have tried in Neuron Writer. So in this case, we're going to hit new query. And the topic for today we're going to try is how to re how to maintain couples relationship after having firstborn baby. Search engine, you can choose in the region that you are in. So in this case, I'm going to choose the United States, the Google US language will be English. And then you can put in additional keywords. Parenting. Couple. Relationship. And I'll hit start. Once you hit start, Neuron Writer is going to search on the internet and look for the top 30 websites that would have those keywords. As you can see right here, it is in 20% of its search. And then once it's completed, it will show you as 100%. So we'll pause this video. Okay, we're back. So it has completed the scan. So if we click inside, it is going to show you the top 30 websites with the keywords that I've put in. The keyword I put in is how to maintain couples relationship after having firstborn baby. And you can, as you can see, these are the other articles title, seven marriage issues after having babies, how to solve them relationship after having a baby. These are very in similar to the content that I want to produce. And looking at their content score, their ranking, and then the length of their article. So some articles are like, you know, 2,600 words. Some are 3,000. Some are just like in 1,200, 1,300. So we'll just choose the top 10. And then we'll click next. What happens is Neuron Writer is going to combine those top 10 websites and then come up with your average number of words you need and then they'll give you a score so what you have to do now is to write your article that you need to rank higher than 59 and then you need an article at least 13 almost 1400 characters now i will use one of my ai content generator from go charlie so inside go charlie i'm going to hit the block one click block I would like to have at least four H2 headers and then two H3 headers. In terms of the block title, I'm going to go back to Nuon Writer. And I do want to see the other people's article title. So clicking on the second, like a pie chart, the top analysis, you can see all their titles here. Right here. And if we want more ideas, we can come back to this page, click on idea. And these are the H1 headers breakdown. And just 
to get some of ideas, references from others. Of course, you don't want to copy them, but just use these as inspirations. Another good place to get a blog article for its for inspiration is the ideas tab, uh, questions to answer. So if you expand this, you can see all these different questions that people ask. You know, how do you maintain a relationship having after having a baby? I think that's pretty decent, which we can use. And some of them are like, you know, why do couples break up after having a baby? How do you keep a relationship strong after having a baby as well? So I think these are, are these are pretty good uh, H1 titles. So what we can do is jump back to Go Charlie. We'll use this one. How do you maintain a relationship after having a baby? And I'll just put how to maintain. I want it to be inform, informative. Target audience, new parents, Britain first time dad, first time mom. I think these are the target audience. Married couples. In terms of SEO keywords. Put in So we'll try these two SEO keywords relationship after having baby, maintain relationship after baby, something similar like this. So we'll hit click right and we'll let go jolly to generate this content. So we'll come back in a minute. Okay, within two minutes, I've got my articles written from GoCharlie. As you can see, the word count is almost 2,000 words. They've given me the meta description, so I can copy this meta description. Copy it. Go back to a non writer in the meta description. I can put paste it in. Now, going back to GoCharlie, and let's just have a quick read, a quick go through how to maintain a relationship after having a baby. Having a baby is a momentous occasion in any relationship and can bring both joy and stress. It can be difficult to know how to maintain a healthy and strong relationship after having a baby, but it is possible in this blog post. We will explore how to maintain a relationship having after having a baby. We will look at ways to reduce expectation, keep communication open, Make time for each other and not to not put too much pressure on each other. With these tips and tricks, you can ensure that your relationship is strong and healthy, even having having the baby. They even suggest you some image suggestion because Go Charlie has text image. So something you can also use, but we're not will not use this in this video. So I'm not gonna read the whole thing. Uh, you can I can just let you have a skim. You can stop the video to read it if you want. What I'll do is copy the entire article and then I will paste it in Nuon Writer inside the content tab. I'll remove this as this is my H1. So from the initial content score from GoCharlie, we got a score of 30. And then th the next step for us is to optimize the content to get more keywords. So what the right hand side of Neuron Writer is going to show you, these are the words, these are the keywords that is expected to be inside your blog post or in your article. So the more you hit these words, your score is going to go up. So we'll take these, we will find an example. For example, for example, they're looking for the word new baby. What we can do here is just to add the word new. And most likely this is going to turn green. 
as you see this one turn green. So the more you start adding, your score is going to go up. So I'll pause this video and just make some adjustments. So I've now optimized probably a portion of this article, but you know you can go on forever and optimize to you know the top score like ninety percent or ninety score of ninety. But if we just look at the the number one competitor. They are ranked at 59. And on the top 10 list, the median score is 41. So I'm currently at 47. So I'll be somewhere in page one. And looking at the readability, the median score is 30, 43. I am 44 right now. So in this case, I'm pretty happy with what I, what I got. But in your own case, if you want to be ranking this at the first, maybe the first or second search results, then you need to crank up your score as high as possible. So overall, I think Neon Writer is a really good uh, content optimizer tool that can help you rank your article on Google. If you want to check out Neon Writer, I'll leave a link down below. There is a free trial, and because Neon Writer will be leaving AppSumo very soon, I think by the time I'm posting this, it might be just less than 15 days. So if you are planning to use this tool to help you optimize your articles for your business, then I will highly recommend you pick up at least three codes, which will get you into the gold plan with all the features available on Neon Writer. So this concludes my video. If you found this content useful, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for future videos. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in my next video.